So let's look at this, this planetary universe shutdown that God has induced. Okay, so the entire planet got shut down, not just us in one part of the country. It's the whole planet got shut down for our incredible future that's coming. And it's slowly dribbling itself in. But I want you to hear this on a kind of an intense level, right? What did the shutdown show you? Because we haven't looked at that. We're looking at poor me, I'm suffering and I'm not getting something. And, and people are really struggling with that because they're being told to suffer. You've been told to suffer for thousands and thousands of years. But what I realized when I looked at people and I was listening to them and what people have been really upset about, again, I'm gonna go through different boxes. I wanted to look at, it was like, okay, you're upset about, and this is just you people in general, whoever in the planet, you're upset about that schools were closed, right? But they weren't upset. People are not upset with the fact that what was being taught were upset with the government shutting down, right? But a lot weren't, a lot of people weren't upset that they shut people down as well as they shut down and they kept getting paid and not you did not, right? You're upset that medicine and, and big pharma or the medical community wouldn't heal you but you weren't upset that they wouldn't allow you to heal yourself with all options of treatment outside of their only one or, one or two options. You're upset that churches are closed, but you weren't upset that, that they, they took away your support groups, keeping you in a consciousness of love, because that's what support and connection creates, love, community, right? You're upset. You weren't upset about, you were, you were less upset about the box, more upset about the box than the community. You're upset that the kids have been like locked down and, and locked away from playgrounds and masked up, but you weren't upset about the children who were being trafficked and abused for thousands of years, now to the extreme that would horrify anyone who knew the full on truth. If you knew the full on truth, okay? You're upset because you want one pill to fix you but you're not upset because every commercial on TV is about a drug that can hurt you for the rest of your life instead of an organic commercial about plant medicine that can heal you for the rest of your life, okay? You're upset because people are telling you what to believe, but your heart, I know all of you here, your heart knows the truth, that something else is causing you to not believe what you hear, which is causing you anxiety, why? We get anxiety because our truth conflicts with what is being told is truth. And you know, it's not your truth, okay? And so you're upset because all of these things for thousands of years, because you had no idea there was no other way. You're upset about these things because you had no other way to understand it until God ah, pushed the pause button and pushed you off the merry-go-round and it hurt right? It hurt when you landed on your butt or your arm or whatever. I, I had all boy cousins, so it hurt for me a lot because they pushed me off all the time. And I'll never forget it, but I got back up and I would get back on and I would do it again. And so now all of you are getting upset for things now, and this is what's great, that are very basic, human core loving needs that are very important to you, that you really want back in your life. And this is fabulous news, you guys. This is amazing news. We're finally going, uh, 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 I want this. So I want you to look at all those things that many people have been upset with for the wrong reasons because you've been told to be upset with them for those reasons because you're not okay. If we tell you you're not okay, and the answer is BS.